To understand what's going on in there, you're gonna need one of these. On the temple, just like this. There's blue light on the door. Yeah, it takes some getting used to. Don't worry, Zoe. I hope. Now listen. The machines we've been fighting, they're different. More dangerous. That means there's something very powerful somewhere beyond that door. And it wants us dead. Follow my lead. And be ready for anything. find the core of it. There's so much metal. Who built this place? Machines. Not like any you've seen before. Machines in here. Let's take them out. Right behind you. Cables are glowing. I've seen them before. They're like an infection. That thing I said, it wants us dead. It takes over places like these and makes killing machines. It's called Hephaestus. Even the hound is like those cages are blocks in the way out. You two wait here. I'll find another path. Okay. There. 
position. on the pillars should be exposed now. Looks like there are only two pillars this time. Twisted around that node on the other side. I'll see if I can get to it. Over 
for you two. It's taken over facilities before to build deadly machines, but it wasn't always hostile. They used to be part of something good, something called Gaia. More of those cables covering the building. I think we're almost at the core. nearby to shut it down.
it's still her god. I do not grieve for a god or a machine. But because I no longer know what to believe. Look, so if you want, you can go back home. Do I still have one? And if so, for how long? Can you really heal our lands? Save my people? One step at a time. But it starts now. we go. But there's more. Like Aloy said, this is only the beginning. Looks like Festus has been upgrading the security Aloy. grid on the call. Aloy, I'm not sure I can do much about that right now. And my focus doesn't recognize some of these. Must be machines I haven't seen yet. Got what you need? Yes. Let's press on then. sound good. Was that the spirit? Minerva? I, I don't think so. I look Attention. All personnel must vacate the facility. Immediately. Something doesn't want us here. What exactly was this place? Error. Seen I anything like it before? Initiate your facility Control. lockdown. Stay out. What's going on? Well, at least the emergency lights work. What just happened? Minerva's definitely here. And I think it's trying to keep us out. I'll scout ahead, see if there's a way to get us in. You sure we shouldn't come with you? Well, yeah, Minerva could be dangerous. Let me make sure it's safe. Okay. We'll be right here if you need us. for a way to access the facility systems. Alert! Restricted access! You are not wanted here. Nope, sorry. You're not getting rid of me that easily, Minerva. I can feel 
feel a draft above. Might be a way out of this shaft. Looks like another part of the facility. that door right now. I should turn back, see what else I can find. Outside. I need to find a way back into the facility. Maybe I could look for a way in higher up the mountain. I'm close. If I can get Minerva to cooperate, I can merge it with Gaia. Finally bring her back. And we can start fixing the blight, the storms. And maybe she can help me figure out how these strangers are improving my war. Why did they have a clone of Elizabeth? Why did they want it back up? to that ledge. Pipes up there. Don't lead me to a way back in. But how to reach them? There's plane song. I hope the Otaru are doing okay after the attack. shaft. Okay, now I've got to find a way to plug into this place. Alert. System core penetrating. Minerva, I need the console. Please. Access denied. It didn't used to be like this. Do you remember it? Anything? You were part of something bigger once. Something good. She can live again. But only if you give her the chance. I can't reboot her without you. Will I cease? I think you'll disappear into her. Become part of her. Like you used to be. Let's cease. Thank you. Thank you, Minerva. <laughs> Elizabeth Sobek. Alpha Prime. Master override activated. 
Restoring Minerva function to original code. Do you wish to initiate heuristic matrix? Here goes. So it is Aloy, not Elizabeth. We have much to discuss, but initialization of my heuristic matrix will not be complete for several minutes more. In the meantime, I suggest you familiarize yourself with this facility. It is our best option for a base of operations, and you can make use of its equipment to improve your ability to override machines. Um, uh, yeah. Yeah, that, that sounds good. Shall I grant access to your companions? They will be here shortly. Um... Okay, but... Don't overwhelm them, okay? They don't have a lot of experience with things like... Well... You. Uh, so no fake this time? No. This time she's real. Borl, so... This is Gaia. Hello. Hi. Hi. Gaia's still, uh, waking up. Let's look around. I will highlight the location of the lab on your focus. Good. So what was this place? A regional control center, where Zero Dawn progeny would have overseen terraforming operations in the area. What's all this? This was intended as the main gathering space. So this was supposed to be... the lab. That was its intended purpose. Some of the machine data you recovered from the repair bay below us appears to be corrupted. Accessing the terminal in this room will show you how to repair and complete the override. I'll take a look. Huh. Looks like I need data from machine parts to fix the corrupted override. My initialization is complete. You may continue to explore the facility, Aloy. When you are ready, return to the control room. We have much to discuss. Okay. Maybe it's time to talk to Gaia. I'll leave you to it. Hello, Aloy. Uh, hi. So you're... ready? Yes. Initialization is complete. All tests show that my heuristic matrix launched correctly and is stable. You must have many questions. Yeah. 
But two big ones first. We're not going to be able to fix the biosphere without making you whole. I ran a search for your subfunctions at the Hades Proving Lab, but Minerva was the only one I found. Thankfully, the sensory capabilities of this facility are far more advanced. I will search for the others now. Transmitting query pattern. Receiving. Of Apollo, Artemis, and Aluvia, I can find no trace. They are simply gone. What about the others? Ether, Demeter, and Poseidon are revealed. They lie within reach. Procurable. And Hephaestus? It too stands revealed, but it is not like the others. <laughs> That's for sure. In the years since the extinction signal, Hephaestus has evolved. Moreover, it is not confined to a single location. It haunts the global network that connects cauldrons to each other across the planet, making it exceptionally difficult to subdue. Let me guess. We need it bad? Correct. Its capabilities are essential. Without it, I can only delay the extinction of life on Earth. Hephaestus is our only hope of a permanent solution. So we start there? Unfortunately, we cannot. Procuring Hephaestus can only be attempted after my own capabilities have been significantly enhanced. Grab the other subordinate functions first, then Hephaestus. Precisely so. So, Aether, Demeter, and Poseidon. How do I capture them? To recover a subordinate function, you will have to travel to its location and find the physical processor to which it escaped. Then, exactly as you did with Minerva, you must use the master override to revert the subordinate function to its original code state. And then how do I get it back here? The subordinate function must be loaded onto a data storage device and physically carried back to this facility. The cartridge your root kernel was stored on? Yes. Its capacity is limited, so it can only carry one subordinate function at a time. But in all other respects, it will suffice. Maybe you can help me make sense of something. A while ago, I had a run-in with a group of... strangers who tried to kill me. They had machine servitors, and a, um, a, a clone of Elizabeth Sobek with them. Yes, this was recorded by your focus. Do you know who they are? The answer to that question is related to the extinction signal that woke Hades, prompting my predecessor's self-destruction. The extinction signal? Okay, that sounds ominous. The signal did not come from Earth, Aloy. The calculations are complicated, but it appears to have originated 81 trillion kilometers away. A distance so vast that light itself requires 8.611 years to cross it. Okay, so... What's so far away, and, and why does it want us dead? The Sirius star system. Sirius? But that's where Far Zenith, their ship... The Odyssey. Yes, that's where it was headed. But it blew up. Unless... Uh, I don't... 
Why make it seem like they failed? They didn't want anyone to know. They didn't want future humans to think that they were out there. Wait. The strangers who tried to kill me at the Hades Proving Lab? The ones with the clone? Are you saying that they're from... That they're descendants of... Farsenith? Yes. That is my conclusion. I guess I should get going and start bringing back subordinate functions. Yes. Once we have them, we can focus on the reacquisition of Hephaestus. When that is achieved, I will have complete control of the Zero Dawn system, and the ability to produce as many machines as needed to defeat the Far Zenith threat. An army of machines. Sounds like a plan. So, the three procurable subfunctions. What can you tell me about their locations? When my predecessor destroyed herself, the subordinate function sought physical processors capable of holding them. So in each case you will be looking for a powerful computer of some kind. Ether is the closest, and therefore might be the easiest to acquire. However, it appears to be in the middle of Tanakt territory. My knowledge of that tribe is limited to data I read on your focus, but they seem to have a significant inclination towards violence. Well, that's a nice way to put it. What about Poseidon and Demeter? Poseidon has taken shelter in the desert south of this location. My substratal geography data indicates that a major old world settlement called Las Vegas was located there. A ruin in the middle of the desert, huh? Strange place for an AI devoted to water. Agreed. As for Demeter, it appears to be located on the coast to the far west. Unfortunately, I am unable to provide any relevant data about the region. As such, it may be the most difficult to retrieve. Okay, so three subordinate functions to go after. Aether, somewhere in Tanakh territory, Poseidon in the desert, and Demeter on the coast. Where will you begin? I think I'll head for Aether. Then I will assign Aether as the objective on your focus. If you obtain it, I may be able to use it to quell the most severe storms in the region. Though I will require Hephaestus and the control over machines that it offers to permanently stabilize the biosphere. Should you change your mind, you can update your objective via your focus interface at any time. I will also transmit a summary of available data on all of the subordinate functions to you for reference. Is there anything else I can help you with? I know you have a great deal to accomplish. I do, don't I? Is something wrong? Um... I don't know. It's just that... Elizabeth set the bar pretty high. She had a dream for you, for life on Earth, and... A lot has gone wrong, and it's all on my shoulders to fix it. Do you think I can do it all? Repair the system? Defeat Varzenith? Live up to her example? Absolutely. In her last message, my predecessor declared her unwavering conviction in your success. In you, all things are possible. You prevailed in purging Hades and rebooting my system core. You will prevail in this. Thank you, Gaia. Well, I, uh, I guess I should get going. I have unlocked the facility's exits. One leads onward to the west. The other leads back down the mountain to Plainsong, should you wish to return east. Varl? Whoa! Gonna have to get used to that. That you, Aloy? Uh, yeah. Gaia's opened the exits to this place. Can you and Zoe meet me by the west door? Be right there. <laughs> Thank you.
Gaia, what is this? It is a control console for a drone-based imaging system connected to this dome. I will transmit the relevant data to your focus. Huh. So this Cyclops is a network of drones to monitor the deteriorating biosphere conditions. I guess it was meant to display on the dome, but the drones aren't connected anymore. If I find the drones out in the wilds, I could get the data from them, use it to reconnect them, and restore the display. Okay, I need to bring Ether back for Gaia. Varl and Zo are waiting for me by the west exit. But I could head back east first. Are you sure? Check on how Plain Song's yes. doing after the attack. I think it'll be better this way. Or I could all. I need to head further west. To, um, get more of Gaia's components. Make her stronger. You two can stay here in the meantime. And Gaia can help get you up to speed. I'm not trying to shut you out. This, it's like... training. Actually, I'm gonna go back east to get Erend. Bring him here. Look, allies, friends, can help. We have a place to stay now. And like you said, Gaia can teach us, catch us up. It'll be okay. Okay. Take these, then. One to wear, one for backup. Are you going with him? No. After what happened in the cave below, I want to stay here a while. There is much I need to understand. Maybe by the time you get back, I'll have a thing or two I can teach you. Looking forward to it. When will you be back? I'm, uh, I'm not sure. But hopefully I'll have one of Gaia's missing components with me. Be careful out there. Even in Plainsong, we heard how the Tanakh clanlands are suffering from storms, machines, and now Regala. Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. Good hunting, Aloy. The Tanoth clan lands. Somewhere out there's three of Gaia's subsections. And who knows what else.
The snow brought the chill. You're sick with blight too. But we'll be able to heal all of it. Once Guy is strong enough to capture Hephaestus. Let's turn into something tasty. The Tanakh settlement. Gonna have to watch my step. Getting close to Aether's location. I said it would be in some kind of physical processor. An ancient ruin. Turned into a Tanakh stronghold? Could Aether be inside? Poking around's not gonna be easy with Tanakh's warriors everywhere. soldiers killed since. Regala's army only grows. Regala's forces may seem strong now, but her machines took out my entire squad. Remember the visions. The old ones didn't choose their fight, but still they stood firm. They didn't falter. And neither will we. Blood of the Ten. You've come to us. You know who I am? Oh, the warrior with hair like wildfire who defeated Regala's champion at Baron Light. <laughs> yes, you are known to us. I am Decca, chaplain of the Lowland clan. You've come to speak with Chief Hikaro. Not quite. There's, there's something I need here. Anything you need, the Chief will provide. Come. Is that one of the visions you were talking about? Yes. The records of the Ten. I can show you them, if you like. On the way to the Chief. All right, let's go see Chief Akaro. He's in his throne room, at the far end of the grove. Come. Be welcome among the records of the Ten.
Soldier and Optic 10. It's glitched. Incomplete. Joint Force 10 at you. Led by Command. These weapons were only the battle. The Ten were dedicated soldiers, working together as a squad and sharing in their duty. And when the time came for battle, they took to the skies and leaped to glory. All Tanakh seek to follow their example. For the Chief, it's one of the few things that... Pla the Chief is inside. Are you ready to see him? I'm ready. Good. Come. We'll see you soon, Outlander. The savior of Meridian. I am told you held back Regala's forces outside Baron Light. And defeated her champion, Grutta, in single combat. Impressive. I met Fashav there, too. He said you were a great warrior. And a man of honor. His death is a painful loss among many. We will not soon recover from the massacre of our marshals. But if you are here to pledge your service, that could help considerably. I am not here to fight for you. I need something in that basement. Something that will save many lives, yours included. It's not something you can see, but it is there. I have seen it. You have named your price. Now I name mine. With my marshals dead, I need your spear. Help me defeat my enemies, and I will grant you access to the chamber below. I don't have a price. I am not a hired killer. I'm here to save lives, more than you can count. I count the corpses of Marshal slain. I count hundreds more to knock them, whose lives hang in the balance. I will fight for them. I will kill anyone who threatens the peace, and you will too, if you want me to open the door to the chamber below. Okay. So by that logic, what's stopping me from killing you right now and taking what I need to save everyone? You could try. You might even succeed. Either way, you must fight. My way might hold off Regala and the slaughter she craves. Fine. What do you need? I need more marshals to keep the tribe together. Such warriors can only be promoted at a trial by combat called the Cool Route. I've sent out a call for the competition. But since Regala seeks to undermine me, she is certain to attack it. She'll want to kill me in front of the assembled clans. So what, you want me to be your bodyguard? No. To defend the cool route. But there is more. Knowing Regala will attack, one of the clans have balked at sending their contestants. You must go north and force Takote, the commander of the Sky Clan, to submit and send his best. Force him to submit? Do whatever is necessary. I can't hold the cool route with two of the three clans in attendance. Marshal Kathala will assist you. He was maimed at Baron Light, 
but he can still be of use. I sent him ahead to the northern village of Stonecrest. Meet him there, and he will guide you to the Sky Clan stronghold. If you have any questions about your mission, now is the time. I'll do what you want, and go north to deal with Dakota. But you'd better not forget about our deal. You will have what was promised, if you succeed. Speak to Decca on your way out. She will arm you for the road ahead. Hikaro said you have something for me? A weapon to aid your mission. You'll need it for the long road to Stonecrest. Many machines prowl along the way, and our scouts have sighted Regala's rebels in the area. Machines and rebels. Nothing I haven't faced before. Indeed. Head north towards the foothills. Ascend its slopes until your legs burn and the chill air catches in your chest. Then you'll know you're in the Sky Clan's domain. Strike true as the ten, Aloy. If I'm gonna get ether, guess I'll have to play along with Akaro. I better meet up with Marshal Catalo at Stonecrest. It'll be faster if I ride a machine. my stash later. You've got to help my friend. Wait. Slow down and explain. Batea and I were heading south with supplies from Saltbite when machines attacked. I left her behind so I could get help from the Grove and ran straight into another machine. Thank the Ten you were here to help. So your friend is still up the road, fighting machines? That's what I'm trying to tell you! I'll bail her out if I can. You go on and get those reinforcements. Will do. I'm in your debt. Yeah. 
Another Tanakh should be somewhere up there. A supply sled. Minus the supplies. And the Tanakh soldier. Hey! Vitae sent me! Sent me. By the ten that lump made it, I thought we were both finished. Let's clear out these machines. Time to lose!
moment. Thanks. If you hadn't shown up, I would have been machine grist. All I did was give your friend here a little time to come to the rescue. Ah, you're full of it. I barely escaped with my life on the road. That I believe. I, uh, hope some of your supplies are still usable. Me too. Food's always scarce. The soldiers at the Grove need the rations. No way we can trek back north to Saltbite to get more. I'll get this one back on her feet and we'll scrape what's left of our haul of the dirt. Mmm, you're making me hungry. Thanks, Outlander. We won't forget what you did. Stay safe, both of you. Cold. Should be getting close to stone crust. Not one more step. The Tanakh don't suffer outlanders in the clan lands. I was given rite of passage by Marshal Fashav. I'm not here to fight. They're like blood. This is the warrior who defeated Gruda, champion of the traitor Regala. Her life is not ours to take. You may enter, but mind our ways. You will be watched. I'll keep that in mind. This must be Stonecrest. Catalo should be waiting for me, but maybe I should look around first. Oh, well sourced, those.
you. Outlander. Come and trade. This valley is infested with regardless rebels. The scouts from the village tell us that they've been moving machines through here for days. Some they ride, others they herd along, and some they even strip for parts. Especially cannons. The path ahead will not be easy. We should get going. My orders are to guide you to the bulwark so that you can speak to Dakota. For all the good it'll do. Not so fast. I'm gonna need a little more than that. So, what's the plan? The bulwark is to the southwest. So undoubtedly we'll have to cross paths with Vergala's troops along the way. We'll either have to fight our way through, or find a way to sneak past unnoticed. Neither will be easy. Never is. <laughs> Let's get this over with. On me. Champ? What you've done for my people is known throughout the clan lands, Easterner. I'd like to help you if I can, lending you my eyes and ears. Nothing happens in this area without me knowing about it. In fact, I should tell you. They say you're a skilled fighter, Outlander. But I wonder how well you'd do against Ereo, one of our combat trainers at the Bulwark. Pretty sure I can hold my own, but it's always room to learn. Well said. Pay Ereo a visit if you can. Maybe I will. How would you convince Dakota to send his challengers? I wouldn't. <sighs> Come on. To knock the respect of Blade and the strength of the fighter who wields it. No good is anyone who lacks that. Well, lucky for us, we're both good fighters, but let's hope it won't come to that. Hmm. So this whole valley is the Sky Clan's territory? Yes. The clan has defended it for generations. Against who? The other Tanakh clans. Even the Karja, long ago. If you want a history lesson, talk to the chaplains. When you Rebels the bird. How did you know I'd agree to machine. help Carl? Got them. Or sneak around. I will follow. Need a rest and a bite. Stiff drink would hurt. Those rebels were gathering machine parts, maybe to make more overrides. And Takote won't do anything? Why would he, when he has the bulwark? I grew up behind the wall. It's easy to have a full sense of safety there. More rebels in the clearing. Well, now 
another alert. Me, you Back at Stonecrest, you said the rebels have been moving through here for days. By the time Takote realizes he's outmatched, this entire valley might be overrun. If not for the sake of the rest of the clan, I would welcome that day. To see his pride ruin. Here it is. The bulwark. Let me know when you are ready, and I will announce us. Marshal requests an audience with your clan commander. I didn't know there were any marshals left. We defend the path to the mountain, where the wings of the ten shall find us. All right, Marshal. I'll send the lift for you. Again. So this was home. A long time ago. Come on. This is a war. From welcome. An outlander and a maimed marshal. A spectacle. Reminds me of where I grew up. I never decided which was worse. When they shunned me, or when they stopped and stared. Right now, 
Lock, trap on the shunned. We're here for Takote. Let us in. Sky Clan's mighty son returns. Bless the Ten. Your chief has demanded an immediate dispatch of all challengers to the Cool Route. We're here to make sure yours haven't gotten lost on their way to the Grove. I see. Regala must have dealt our chief a mighty blow. If he's sending you two as messengers. This one defeated Regala's champion, Grutta, at the embassy. She fought honorably. I had the sense to bar our soldiers from that embassy. Just as I have the sense now to keep our challengers here. If they must fight, then they will fight here. Defending our walls. Our clan. That wall won't protect you. Not from the machines Regala controls. They're already at your doorstep. <laughs> and what do you know? the battles that the bulwark has withstood. The blood shed upon stone. I know it wasn't meant to be used as a coward's shield. You were a great warrior once. But that was then. You tell Hakaro, with all due respect, that we will keep our challengers here for as long as we are safe behind the bulwark. I told you, words are useless with his kind. We're gonna have to kill him. It won't be easy with all his men above. Are you even listening? For as long as we are safe behind the bulwark, he said. Wait here. I need to get a closer look at that wall. What? Why? Ooh. The snow brought the chill. might not be as strong as Dakota thinks it is. I need to get down to the base of it and check it out. Your blade be bright. Thank you. 
Beaten already, Outlander. Oh, just you wait. I need to get a little distance from the wall in order to scan it properly. Just what I thought. There's something metal in there. Oh, that rock is interfering with the scan. I need to get closer. But how? I might be able to climb up on the left side of the wall. Near that waterfall. Focus might find something I missed. Where is this water coming from? Now, better scan that tank again. Power core. I'll bet if I blew it up. But how? Well, can't do anything else here. Better go find Catalo. said you've been scurrying around the wall like a rat. What in the name of the town have you been up to? Takote said he wouldn't send his challengers as long as they're safe behind the bulwark. Right? Oh, don't remind me. So? We take it down. Did you hit your head on the way down here? I'm serious. There's something from the old world stuck in there, and it has a power cell. I could blow it up if I just penetrate the first layer of rock and Even metal. Even if what you're saying is true, it would take a cannon to do that. You're right. And you said the rebels were stripping them off machines back in the valley. Come on. No. I'm not getting dragged further into this madness. Hikaru ordered you to help me. You gonna defy him like that arrogant shit up there? Kind comparison. The rebels might have made camp northeast of here. And then what? The two of us go up against all of them? Pretty much, yeah. Well, you may lack sense. But you don't lack courage. So, um, back there with Dakota? It seemed like there's bad blood between you two. There is. If we make it through this plan of yours, perhaps I'll tell you. I'll hold you to that. We're getting close to where we saw the rebels before. Well, it looks like the rebels just got a lot more firepower. Ready? Move out! on the others. I'll follow you in.
cross would do a lot of damage.
I'm not looking forward to hauling this all the way to the bulwark. Mm. Here. I may be maimed, but I've still got a strong back. After you. Hey, you fought well back there. I did not think we'd survive, but killing the rebels and the machine, it was good to take the fight to them for once. You really think this thing will do the job? I'll know soon enough. You don't just need a cannon. You need a miracle. Coming right up? Well, go on. Okay. Gotta blast away some rocks. So I can... It's working! Isn't this impressive? Two children playing siege. I hope they haven't hurt the Bulwark's feelings. Come now, stop embarrassing yourselves. And leave this poor mountain alone. This is your last chance, Takote. You can still answer Hikaru's call. This is your last chance. You have it backwards. Leave this place, Savage, now. And take this cripple with you. behind the wall anymore, Takote. Now you have to join Hikaro. Never. Never. We will... We will rebuild it. Immediately. You are not safe. The Bulwark couldn't protect you from a single cannon, let alone an army of machines. The only pathway to safety is to unite against Regala with your chief. You decreed that no challenges would be sent, while the clan remained safe behind the bulwark. So send them now, unless your word means nothing. Send them. I didn't hear you. Send the challengers. I look forward to seeing the Sky Clan's colors in the arena. Nicely done, Marshal. What's gonna happen to this place? They'll have to live without their wall. But that's better than living apart from the tribe, as pawns in Takote's foolish schemes. If you want to check up on them, talk to Jera, the chaplain of the clan. If anyone needs help up there, she'll know. Yeah, maybe I will. I'll take my leave then. I need to report to Hikaru. I'll see you at the culvert. Good. We may need another miracle there as well. I have to get 
to explore more to find the parts I need. Maybe I should go up there, see if everyone's all right, and find this chaplain, Gara. Might also be a good idea to resupply before I head back out. Are you sure I can't tempt you? Pass. Outlander, Chief Akaro and Marshal Katalo await you within.